know your IS code provisions short lecture series. So in this short lecture, I will explain about weak story. Weak story is one of the vertical irregularities and it is linked with the strength. So soft story and weak story. Soft story is stiffness irregularity. Weak story is strength irregularity. So what is the definition? When do we consider uh, story as weak story? If the strength, lateral strength of any story is less compared to the lateral strength of the story above. So that is the definition of weak story. So what are the code provisions to safeguard against this uh, vertically regularity condition? Uh, let us look into those details. So let me share my screen. <coughs> yeah, weak story, that is one of the vertical irregularities. So weak story causes uh, strength discontinuity. Actually strength discontinuity is a serious issue. The strength is lateral strength lateral strength discontinuity this is a serious issue and uh, when there is strength discontinuity at these junctions where the, this discontinuity is present there will be huge displacement demand because of the lateral forces and because of this say uh, local weak region this region or that story will suffer severe damage sometimes leading to collapse. Now, a weak story is a story whose lateral strength is less than that of the story above. That is the uh, clause. So as you can see in this one, SI, SI plus one and SI plus two, these are different, different stories. Here in this case, SI, SI plus one. So here, what code says is, if SI is less than SI plus one, that means strength of ith floor is less than strength of I plus one floor or strength of I plus one floor is less than strength of I plus two or I plus second. So if, so the definition says, if the strength of any floor is less than the strength of the immediate floor above. So that is uh, like a weak story. That is strength irregularity. So what is the definition of this one? It is one in which the story lateral strength is less than that in the story above. So this is from the definitions. That is section number four. So cumulative design shared strength of all structural members other than that of unreinforced masonry infills. So for finding out this lateral strength, masonry infill strength, lateral strength is ignored. And the cumulative strength of all the structural elements, cumulative strength in that, like falling in that plane, so the story strength, lateral strength is a total strength of all seismic force resisting elements sharing the lateral uh, story share in the considered direction. So whatever is coming in that uh, uh, floor from the diaphragm, actually uh, force because of the resistance, it is transferred to the base. So strength of lateral strength of all the uh, lateral load resisting element in that floor. Suppose say like uh, six, six uh, uh, frames are there in, in that uh, direction, X direction. The addition of all six floor, six uh, frames strength in that, in that direction or X direction. <coughs> so what clause says is if that is there, if such condition is there, so building with strength irregularity shall not be permitted. And in case the weak story is because of unreinforced masonry infills, provision of 7.10 shall be followed. So this is a, uh, open ground story structure. So code is very uh, stringent for this uh, vertical irregularity. That is in case strength irregularity is there or weak story is there. So there'll be huge uh, displacement demand, especially like to understand how much displacement demand is there. So pushover analysis is recommended. So if there is a strength irregularity, that is that is not uh, permitted in the structural design. So the aim of this short lecture is to help uh, students in practice engineering to understand IS code provisions in a better manner. 
following references have been used in the preparation of this short lecture. So thank you.